Hey there, this is KFRAIN Knowledge for All. In this video today we are going to learn how to use Game Maker Drag and Draw block which is called Stop Following Path. In previous video we have defined some kind of zombie enemy and the path he is going to follow and move along uh, to look like he's kind of guarding some kind of um, go golden coins so player cannot touch them. In this video we are going to stop him by uh, for example clicking on him but it doesn't have to be that it can be like uh, in your game maybe shooting or touching some kind of obstacle or maybe like I don't know in uh, Plants vs Zombies where you have a zombie uh, uh, when he touches some kind of um, obstacle like that uh, nut or something like that he stops he cannot move along the path so uh, you can use that for different reasons uh, so uh, this will be much much shorter than previous video but uh, again nevertheless based on the same pr principles and uh, it can be used as I just said in different uh, variations and uh, purposes so um, experiment with it and um, don't forget it use it when you need it if you need it uh, okay so again uh, I want to stop this guy this uh, green uh, zombie when I click on him so when I click on, click on him is defined in game maker by events and when I click I mean clicking with my mouse so I need to find the event which says mouse click or something like that. So click on these events window, click on add event, click on or just hover over the mouse. And there are so many of those, but we need left press. That is like one click left down means you hold your left mouse button down, uh, left release, you release. It. So um, left pressed. I need that one I want that one and I want to do what when I left click on my zombie guy here I don't know where he is on the path I don't care I just want him to stop so let me find the path stop stop following path stop an instance from following a path click that is the second from the left click and drag it here do not change these uh, 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 options because we need it just on this obj zombie path and i think now when i click on this guy he will stop yeah uh, does it make sense in this um, example not much because again this is just a short example and and <coughs> not finished game sorry but um, again it can be some kind of um, tower which shoots uh, some kind of um, I don't know ice ice bolts uh, which pose the uh, zombie <clears throat> or maybe we could make a game where you uh, pose the I don't know automobiles uh, by clicking on them uh, so uh, people can cross the street like uh, a traffic uh, game uh, and so on so again just crazy ideas but um, um, it's it's just example <laughs> so um, and you can play with it so for example <clears throat> I have stopped this guy now so my game designer says okay that's cool I want him to stop when the player clicks on him with the left button but I want him to go on later when the player right clicks on him with right mouse button so I need to add another event again mouse but this time right pressed and um, what am I going to use I have stopped him with left mouse I will <coughs> I think I can just copy this one I will create copy this block I will just make him start following when I right press so again right press and the problem here it will be absolute true I think let me check 
so um, I will leave him to walk a little bit just to test it stop with left mouse button right click and you see how he jumped on the beginning I don't want him to do that and he does that because absolute true means go to absolute beginner absolute start which is here that is the first point which we have created that is the start this point here that is our start okay so I don't want him to go to absolute start so just uncheck this and then I think this will work so we have some kind of simple um, I don't know it's not a game but it's mechanics moment uh, left click stop right click oh no he again he creates his own uh, because yeah reverse maybe that's on end mm, I think this is something I need to change but anyway or maybe just absolute true let me try without without these reverse options so I will just uh, make him stop and move once stop no he's again going crazy he's going crazy and uh, uh, absolute true yeah because I'm making lots of changes I hope this doesn't confuse you but it probably does when he starts the game I want him to follow to follow the path and then stop okay that works but the problem here is when I right press he go back he goes back in reverse so I would have to change something here I think that is not very important for this video anyway um, I will find the solution when I probably stop this video but uh, and tell you in another but so far so good let's make this video shorter uh, we have learned how to stop this guy following path so uh, in next video we will continue with playing with those other uh, drag and drop blocks because there are a couple of those to check see you then thanks for watching bye for now